G'day shooters, Aaron here from Shooting Stuff Australia. And today I am here with the Elite Tactical Systems Mag Loader. It's a plundered sort of a design, it comes with two pieces. It's meant to make your mags loaded a lot faster than doing it by hand. It comes in two styles, one is the 45 and the other is a 38 and a 9mm. We're giving it a go on the 9mm magazines. It says that it can do all single stack and double stack without ruining the feed lip. So we'll be putting this to the test. It did say you got to lube it a bit. So I have pre-lubed some of this with a bit of gun oil like they said. So we'll be trying out several different magazines. We've got a couple of SIG, Breda and an aftermarket Breda magazine. We'll see if all these load. We'll start off with the factory ammunition and see how this goes. So yeah, this is the Breda magazine. This mag's got to be in there all the way first up. Slide it across the top. There's your 10. And you should just be able to plunge it down without much effort, hopefully. <coughs> yeah, that's... Um, Well, it worked, so that's good. A little bit of effort involved though. This is a bit slippery, but it worked. That moved around quite a bit, so I've got a gun mat here that hopefully will eliminate that problem. We'll try the P226 magazine. A lot easier. Yeah, definitely make sure you've got a non-slip surface. We'll give the aftermarket Breda magazine a go. Yep. Straight in, seem to work. That's awesome. Now my favourite gun, my Sig Sauer P320 magazine. going in there not even one let's try that again nope it ain't working got my second SIG P320 magazine, so we'll see if this one will work. We'll try the reloads this time. <coughs> nah. Not at all, not good. That's not going in for the life of me. I'm not too happy it doesn't work in my favourite gun, but we'll try this again. No, it's not going in at all. Not at all. Okay, a little bit of extra gun oil. Third time lucky, see if this works. <coughs> I 
No. Well, that was a little bit disappointing for me because it didn't load my P320 magazines. I did get the calipers out and it's just slightly smaller by a fraction of a millimetre the opening on top compared to the other magazines we used. Now it does say here that it saves time, energy and your thumbs. I don't really know how much time it saves compared to loading by hand and for energy it takes a lot of energy to, to load one of these. If you don't have the upper body strength or if you're an older shooter or a smaller frame I think you're going to struggle getting the rounds through here into here. So it comes, with a, it comes with a lifetime warranty, that's probably good because the amount of force you're going to use on this, you never know if you're going to break it, but it is of a strong construction so that's one good thing about it. So if, before you spend $70 on something like this or any speed loader at all, you've got to think, is it going to save you much time for the money? Or I can load my magazines pretty fast by hand without much of an effort at all. Please sound off in the comments section if you brought one of these and how you found this and how to work for you if you had any problems with any magazines like I did with the SIG magazine. It would be very interesting and it would probably be helpful to a lot of other people as well who think of spending this sort of money on this. So if you like these sort of gadget videos, please hit subscribe to the channel, sign up to Patreon if you'd like to support us and thanks again for watching.